The ayat e karima, also referred to as the supplication of Yunus, alayhi salam, is a powerful verse from the Quran known for its importance in seeking Allah's help and forgiveness. The verse is, La ilaha illa anta subhanaka inni kuntu min al Here's what you should know about ayat e karima as a wazifa. Islamic practice. Significance. This verse is associated with Prophet Yunus, alayhi salam, supplication when he was swallowed by the whale. Reciting it signifies acknowledging Allah's power and seeking forgiveness for wrongdoing. Benefits. Many hadiths describe the virtues of reciting this verse. It is believed to bring comfort in difficulty, lead to forgiveness, and be a powerful dua, prayer. How to recite ayat e karima as wazifa. You should recite ayat e karima 111 after fajr and asar prayer for your needs. However, some recommendations include focus and sincerity. Recite with a clean heart, focusing on the meaning and sincerity towards Allah. Supplication. After reciting, you must pray to Allah Pak, expressing your needs and desires.